Hello guys, Ivan here and welcome to a new video. So here we are today with the new Mercedes Maybach S680 V12 version for Matic. And in this video we will check out the exterior interior and also the infotainment of this V12 limousine. This is the top dock, the 680, so we have a V12 engine, 6.0 liter by turbo. Even more luxurious and even more high-end. Check it out. And check out how beautiful it is here. And special thanks to AMG Performance Center Bratislava Lamač in Bratislava, Slovakia for having us here today with the Maybach. So first let's check out the exterior. So here we have the obsidian black metallic. So this paint is on many models by Mercedes for many years. So we can say this is the like flagship color which many people actually buy for different models. G-Wagon, S-Class, uh, etc. So many many models are in this obsidian black metallic and I think the, it's, it's a color which you cannot uh, like go wrong with. Also uh, the same like with the white one. And uh, the limousine especially here in the black it's, it's a, like a classic spec we can say. And this is the top dock the 680 so we have a V12 engine. Uh, the masterpiece here. The really like a pinnacle of the automotive um, luxury. Automotive, automotive uh, masterpiece so this car as you can see has a lot of chrome and that is because it is a Maybach so you can see a lot of chrome here around the windows also here in the front but the 680 has chrome also uh, on these radiator vents so here and in the middle you can see that this is in chrome and this is the 680 model the 580 V8 model also fantastic car has a uh, uh, this vent has in black, so uh, you can differentiate this uh, very easily like that. Also, you can see this large grill for Maybach. Let me you know how do you like this. And also here in the middle is hidden radar for the Distronic, and this is actually smooth, so it looks like it's 3D. I really like how they did it uh, with this one. It's really really amazing. So here on the bonnet you can see the Mercedes logo, and also. We have one chrome stripe in the middle of the front hood and you can see how the Mercedes logo is aerodynamically shaped so uh, it is aerodynamically adjusted for better airflow so it's leaning a little bit towards the back of the car and let me know how do you like this design I think it's a real masterpiece with Maybach so here we have also digital light technology the best from Mercedes-Benz and also for the Maybach is the same. You can see a lot of blue details here. Mercedes-Benz. So these are projector lights with millions of micromirrors. And they can cut out ongoing traffic and project symbols on the road. Very, very cool lights and super safe super useful so that's also really great so you can see how long this bonnet is on the s class but the major benefit of the maybach is a rear section of the car look how wide it is also has a window here in the back so that's also unique for the maybach so this car is even longer than uh, s class long wheelbase so really big difference also the pillows here you can see are in chrome that's only for the Maybach and these in the middle and uh, the window trim is in chrome uh, so that's very very cool also here and the front fender we have the V12 to differentiate between the V8 and V12 So here are these beautiful Maybach wheels. You can see the Maybach lettering in the middle. And absolutely gorgeous chrome. And on the inside we have a gloss black. So it looks absolutely fantastic. So the front tire size is 265, 35, 21 inch. And the rear tire size we will check shortly. These are also Pirelli P0 tires. So the rears are 265, 35, 21. So basically we have the same on the front and also at the back and that's because you don't really need wider tires 
for comfortable driving only uh, usually for the performance also my back logo here at the C pillar uh, looking really really wonderful also here we have my back lettering on the left side Mercedes in the middle and S680 on the right side and in between we have actually this chrome line which really connects the whole back of the vehicle so it looks rather special also what we have here is the line on the rear bumper which is in chrome as well as this one in the middle the side skirt so it continues from the side skirt towards the back and check out here when I unlock the car the LED indicators when I lock it we can see it as well also here we have a lot of chrome around the exhaust so the exhaust itself is in chrome but also the insert on the inside of the exhaust here is in chrome and also in between the exhaust and above the exhaust they have also chrome line so as much as chrome as possible is here in this car let me know what you think about this and how do you like this so I think it looks rather special here with the chrome bits right so now we can open the front hood alright so now it's time to open the hood and check out this power plant so as you can see here with 12 so we have 12 cylinders so this is 6.0 liter by turbo v12 engine and it is a real real masterpiece you can see here my logo and mercedes logo as well so this one produces 612 horsepower and 900 newton meters of torque and the acceleration from 0 to 100 kilometers per hour or 62 miles per hour is four and a half seconds so this car is very fast considering its size and the top speed is 250 kilometers per hour or 155 miles per hour and this engine is mated to 9 speed automatic transmission 9G and especially in Maybach it has a special driving mode which makes the car even softer and even more smooth than the we can say quote unquote regular S class so let me know what do you think about the performance and this engine in the comment section down below all right so one more time let's check out the rear of the vehicle so you can see the large c pillar makes the car looks really exclusive and executive style and yeah overall i'm really big fan of the silhouette of this Maybach S-Class it looks even more luxurious and even more high-end than the long wheelbase S-Class for sure the added length gives this car a big presence that's for sure and chrome as well so so you will immediately notice that there is much more chrome than on the regular S-Class all right so now it's time to hop inside and check out this amazing Maybach interior so if you press or swipe the beautiful pop-up door handles they are also illuminated in the night and if you swipe they will open also we have here the urban guards protected so this system actually can send photographs of a person uh, and show it to you uh, who has done some damage to your car and here is this beautiful interior of the Maybach S-Class check out how thick the door is to give you ultimate protection from the outside noises and yeah absolutely wonderful interior here first glance immediately Maybach logo here absolutely stunning also check out here the animation when I turn off the car And you can also open or close rear doors here with these sliders all right so now we can see this beautiful ambient lighting as well in blue color 
and check out this amazing exclusive Napa leather. This one is Sienna Brown. It has really nice, this sort of like a clay cord, uh, sort of shade. So let me know what do you think. And also this beautiful walnut decor. Absolutely stunning. Also, here we have the Maybach illuminated when you enter the car. If you have AMG model, then you have AMG. If you have Mercedes Benz, then you have Mercedes Benz. And here for the Maybach, we have special the Maybach. Also, check it out here 4D surround sound system. The best which you can possibly get the 4D Burmester surround sound system. Also, you have speaker here and also one here. So, only in the doors you have three speakers. So check it out. One, two, and three. Beautiful diamond stitching. And uh, as well here in the seats. So let's hop inside. The seats are super plush and super comfortable. Also, you can open here the boot with the button. And we have some door pockets here as well. Now when we close off close. It's super, super cool and super silent in here. You cannot hear any outside noises. And look how much space do I have. If I would be a very tall person, I could sit here without any issues. So check out this amazing interior of the S-Class. It's really this sort of simplistic, but also high technology interior. So we have large driver screen here and also this portrait screen in the middle for the central system infotainment. So we can also change here uh, the design. I really like this one, it's the Maybach. Then you can have sport, understated, more classic, navigation, assistance or service. So I really like Maybach. I would probably use this most of the time. It looks so so cool. Also this changes and the lower part where is the AC is in white. Otherwise, check it out, if we change to classic, it will be in black. So it's like blends with the screen. But for me, I really like because I uh, in most cars you will have this. So if you have Maybach, then you have Exclusio, which is white in the lower part. It's like a light gray, we can say, this kind of color. Also, here we can check out the settings. So what kind of uh, brightness do we have here? So display brightness. Now we have on the zero. So you can have minus 10 during night and plus 10 we will increase right now. So you can see. So you can increase this to plus 10 all the way. And also you can change uh, how the you can also change the here the control elements how it actually feels. So if it feels like mm, not really fast, you can also change it here to fast, which I really like that you can do that. And also here, check it out. So here we have Maybach lettering, and on the inside here you can find Maybach logos. Check it out; they are very like soft but like in 3D they are like uh, going into the distance and also here you have this sort of like a classic design of the Speedos with Maybach logo as well and rose gold details absolutely stunning this is all digital but it looks so so like realistic like 3D absolutely fantastic so let me know how to like this also here we have the steering wheel with Maybach on the lower part and here with the horn and airbag it's stitched in the black napa leather also on the top of the doors you can see the black color of the Maybach design here on the top of the doors and on the top of the dashboard you can find the napa leather also in black i will just lower a little bit the ac but it should be fine okay so this should keep us pretty pretty cool. We can sync the temperature as well. So today it doesn't really seem, it's like 23 degrees. 
in Celsius, in Fahrenheit. Uh, you can check it out on the screen. The first day, which is quite hot. So, uh, yeah, I'm in the t-shirt and it feels like it's really hot. Also, you can lower the windows with the buttons here. And also, if you press this one, you can actually raise here the sunshade in the back. Check it out. And you can also lower it. Check it out. So the steering wheel has capacitive buttons, but there are like these indent indentations in them, so you can easily, easier, uh, you can distinguish where are the buttons. Also, you can lock, unlock the car. All right, so here is the key fob for this particular car. You can see like chrome on the outside and gloss black in the middle. You have also Maybach logo here. Absolutely stunning. You can also open the boot here and from the back we have a high gloss black color so the new style exclusive key fob see how beautifully this wood trim actually shines when it's uh, sunny looks absolutely stunning little bit it looks like this um, mediterranean wood in my opinion which you can find on the yachts and uh, stuff like that around the coastal areas so it looks really high-end and absolutely stunning in my opinion let me know what you think also these aluminum lines they add a lot of nice details uh, with the car so we have seen this also in for example like a c-class but with different uh, kind of a little bit different twist but here it's absolutely stunning in this in this beautiful wood absolute masterpiece so here we have the air vents they are now blowing air on us which we don't really want uh, because of the microphone but you can actually change how much it should blow so it's not really blinking in real life but if you press you will have only two so it blows uh, much less if you press one more time then you have only one so you can actually change how much it should blow air on yourself you can also turn it off completely you can do that also for this side, also here, also here you have three levels, and also on that side. So the air vents, they are super nicely like uh, included in the design of the dashboard, which I really like. You can also move these up and down, they are like nice and clicky. And here on the top, if you take a look, you can see stitching, that's because we have Nappa leather on the headliner. So you can find these in Maybach, only in the Maybach, which is absolutely gorgeous. Also this illuminated panel in the middle. Also here we have a sun visor. So if I open it, you can see the mirror and light. And also you can detach this, put it on the side. And now you can also fold this one. So now you have two at the same time, which is really useful. So check it out now, you have a one in the front and one on the side. I think more, uh, more cars should have this feature, not only this one, and I really like this one. Also, the grab handle here is beautifully done in leather, Napa leather, absolutely fantastic. A little bit of the chrome, and the whole headliner is in uh, Napa leather, basically, which really is uh, exclusive. Also, here we have adaptive cup holders, some storage space and two USB-C ports which are illuminated and wireless charging for a phone. Also here we have some storage space and also two uh, armrests. So if I open here you can see some storage space, two USB-C ports illuminated as well. And yeah, it's pretty nice size, not very deep but pretty nice. And here you can see on the right side so if we open this then you can see the perfume diffuser and also some storage space on the inside lower part of the door cards is also in black and the uh, sienna brown continues here on the upper level so it's nicely matched you can see like in the layers black a brown and again black so here we have the seats super super plush and comfortable also with these Maybach logos on the cushions, on the pillows and beautifully made with the diamond pattern, diamond stitching. Also these seats are ventilated, check out this beautiful uh, work of these seats. Also with this black lining 
So super modern and super nice luxury seats. Check out how large is this panoramic sunroof. Also here with the a large speaker for the Burmester system. So the sound here is really crazy. You can also close here the panoramic sunroof. So you can also partially close it here with this button. If you press it, if you press this button, then the rear section closes only the rear. So you can decide which one do you want to close. So like this, and the front one can be opened. Also, you can put on the sunshades in the back here with these two buttons. So if I press this one up, you can see that it will close the sunshades. Here we have the business class seats, which we'll check shortly in the back of the beautiful Maybach. All right, guys, so now let's check out the rear section, the first class section. Soft close and you can also open it automatically. So you can see how large it is. Also here we have screens in the back. Check it out. Also how comfortable it looks in the back. So we will hop inside shortly. But here if I press this button here, we will get the first class position. So let's check it out. So now the front seat will go as far as possible in the front to give you even more space in the back and check out the rear seat will also uh, make even more space in the back. So we will see it now, check it out. Also calf support is extended and the seat itself is like more in the sort of laying position. Check it out here as well. So now we can very comfortably sleep and rest in the Maybach. You can also change the angle here and you can retract the cup support as well. I changed the angle. If you don't really are comfortable with this version, with this setting, and also check it out, you can also retract it if you don't really want to use this. Alright, so here if you press the button, the doors will close and you can do that with the button. Check it out. And also check out the seat belt extender. In the seat belt we have the airbag, so this one is the belt bag. And check out how beautiful it is here in the back of the Maybach. How much room do I have here? It's absolutely uh, crazy in here. Also here we can change how much we have actually air coming in. Also here we can turn on or off uh, how much air it's coming through the vents. Also here we can turn this on. And in the middle you have this console, where you can put the champagne flutes. Also, you can cool and heat up. You can see the blue and red, your drinks. And also here we have the section where you can change the AC for the rear passengers, with Maybach lettering as well. So this one you can close. If you don't really want to use this anymore, you can nicely close this panel, the, this front central panel. And check out how amazing this looks. In the middle we have the tables, so you can extend these. And you can basically have the mobile office here. And on the inside we have the same color as here of the leather. So super useful and super cool. And you can also see here, while it's charging for a phone, some storage space. Four USB-C ports and two HDMI ports. And also here we have the 12 volt socket. And here with this one you can close the middle compartment. And then you have place here for the 
tablet. So here is the belt bag which I was talking about. You can see it here, the belt bag. And the, on the inside of the seat belt there is a airbag which is really really wonderful to uh, give you even more security. Check out here this chrome line on the inside. It gives this very super nice cocoon like. Also here we have the sun shades on this smaller window uh, in the back. Check it out. Also here Also, above my head, here is a speaker, grab handle, which is uh, even wider than in the front. Also, here we have settings for the lights. And today, sunshine, you can see here the Burmester speaker with ambient lighting. And we can actually close this part of the roof, I think. So, let's try to find this. Okay, so with this button, with this one on the right side, we can close. Now it's even better because it, it's too much sun, too sunny today. We can close the rear one with this button. So check it out. And you can also close this one for yourself. And check out how it hides on the inside. And if you don't know about this feature, you cannot even see this. Super, super cool, these nets. And check out here this beautiful wood decor. So here on the inside we have a fridge actually, with two levels of cooling. So you can press, so you can press twice here and have a two levels of cooling, or only one, or you can turn it off. And here we can find the fridge, so let's open it. And here we have a place to cool down the drinks. And here on the top we have actually place for the flutes. So you can have these in silver. They come with the car, so you can place them here. And you can see ambient lighting around the seats in this like a cocoon style. They continue there and also in the middle. How fantastic is this? Absolutely stunning. And also check out here the Maybach logo and some storage space. And here we can find also beautiful ambient lighting around this section and also the screen. Now you cannot uh, control it, so you have here the tablet which you can control the infotainment system with. And you can control many stuff, same as in the front here in the back. If you press this button, then you can move the front seat forwards or backwards, or up and down. And here if you press, you can close the rear doors super easily and automatically. Alright, so now we can check out the boot. So there is a little bit less capacity because of the cooler here, because of the fridge. But we have a still pretty nice capacity. And you can also open the boot floor. Here you can find some additional cargo space. And here you'll find some accessories as well. Here you have accessories to the car, as well as the flutes, uh, etc. Perfumes, uh, also the headphones. These are, I believe, the headphones. Yes, these are the headphones. And here you have additional stuff which comes with the car. Also these cushions here as well and first aid kit and you can close it with the button of course all right guys so that's it for this video let me know how you like the s680 maybach here with the first class section in the back in the comment section down below don't forget to like and subscribe and turn on all notifications so you're notified for all future episodes thank you very much for your support and i will see you soon in the next video have a wonderful day.